Well, you get a lot of sunrise and sunset pictures around here, but none quite this nice. Bill Riggs, a uh, little cruise, I would imagine, on the kayak on the Platte River, maybe. A beautiful view there, and that is actually a sunset. Thanks, Bill, for that one. And the snow goose season, it lasted, what, about three weeks, maybe. It peaked last weekend. And these are some of the bigger numbers that we've had pictures from. Uh, 191 here and uh, right here, 357. Spelling them out, and that is in one hunt. A lot of people may say, oh, me, oh, my, oh, but that is exactly what needs to be done with the snow goose population. Hunters are not keeping ahead of the game. These birds are overpopulated, and they've wiped out roughly two-thirds of the shoreline habitat of Hudson Bay. And if you look at a map, that is a lot. These birds pull plants up by the roots, so uh, they're kind of a detriment to themselves and others. March 15th, that's this Thursday, the plotage, you've probably all read through it by now. It is the 16th annual banquet for the Central Nebraska chapter of the National Wild Turkey Federation. So that's coming up on the uh, 15th and then for St. Patty's Day next Saturday. The state convention for DU in Grand Island actually starts on Friday. And the banquet itself, the dinner if you will, an auction, will be on Saturday night. And uh, elsewhere, we see the DU Banquet on the 31st and Hagler. Doors open at 5 p.m. It is the Binkelman area dinner of Ducks Unlimited. And the annual Mountain Oyster Feed, Saturday, March 24th. All you can eat, the Elba Fire Department, adults $10, youth $5. These guys got a recipe. It's like 40-some years old, and it is a good one. Saturday, March 17th, another banquet, this for Pheasants Forever, the 20th annual Boone County Banquet in Albion, and then the 24th of March, it will be the 7th annual Franklin County Quail Forever Banquet, and of course, that will be in Franklin. If you've got pictures you'd like to send in, or just like some of us on Facebook, for instance, the NWTF of Nebraska, and you can always send your pictures to me at theoutdoorfiles.com. That's a look at the outdoor files. Annie, back to you.